How's it going everyone? My name is Potato and welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto 5 video. Today we're going to be going over covering, talking about, and discussing the Criminal Mastermind Heist Challenge. And this is some information that we got last week and we really didn't know too much about it. I touched base on it really quick, but since Heist of course were not yet released, we didn't know exactly how this would work. Like I said, we only kind of knew the basics and since then in the last six days someone has actually gone out and completed the Criminal Mastermind Heist Challenge and if you guys are unfamiliar with how that works basically what this is is each set of heists, each of the five have their own unique uh, challenges going along with them that can earn you extra money, RP, job points, etc. and the Criminal Mastermind Heist Challenge involves all of those and what it is basically is you need to complete all five heists and, and this is including the setup missions as well you must complete them in order with the same team on hard difficulty and with zero deaths so this is very hard but the end result is is very well worth it it's 12 million dollars and it's 10 million I believe it, without some of the extra bonuses but if you get the extra bonuses as well you will get 12 million dollars and that's crazy and like I said someone in the community has actually gone out and completed this challenge and it's really awesome I'm actually gonna link the forum post down below uh, these guys posted it on there as well as uh, they posted a YouTube video as well showing off them completing this heist so or this challenge excuse me so it's very interesting and with this video hopefully I can give you guys some tips on how you can complete this yourself and how you can earn yourself 12 million dollars in GTA online so if you guys do go on to enjoy the video I would definitely encourage you to leave a like if we could go for 200 likes that would be awesome as well as be sure to subscribe if you are new around here that way you never miss out on an upload also, we are on the road to 80,000 subscribers, so any help would be greatly appreciated. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So, as I mentioned and listed off a minute ago, you have to complete this, and this is including the setup missions, in order with the same team on hard difficulty and with no deaths. Now, I tried this. We got to the third uh, heist mission, the Humane Labs raid, but it's just, it, just different time constraints and schedules and trying to get everybody on time to do this and at the right time. It's very difficult and that's the issue that I ran into, but I want to mention that, like I said, you cannot have any deaths when doing this. However, if you do fail a heist mission and that has to do with, say, not dying, but say you run out of time or something along those lines, that is acceptable. That will not restart the, the this challenge at all. So that's not going to void that and cancel it out. And this has been confirmed by the people who actually completed this challenge. So that's awesome. That's a plus. Now, some tips in regarding how to actually uh, complete this challenge and, and do it and utilize things to the best of your ability. I would definitely recommend you to say when you're choosing your custom vehicles, you know, it's awesome having a Zentorno or an Adder to be able to quickly get to your destination and the high setup missions and etc. What you're trying to do, but you need to kind of take into consideration what has Rockstar given you. They've given us the Karen Karuma, the Heavy Insurgent, if you've unlocked that, etc. And vehicles like that that are bulletproof, that are armored. Definitely use those. Just cancel out the Zentornos, the Adders, the supercars, etc. Use the Karen Karuma. That in that car, you're basically uh, indestructible. You know, you cannot get destroyed. You will take a lot less damage than you would in a normal car and, and things like that. So definitely use things like that to your advantage. As well as there is a new armored high suit, and I, I forget the actual name of it, but uh, I, you guys probably know what I'm talking about. And excuse me for not knowing the name of it, but it, it's like this juggernaut type suit. And just utilizing things like that, yes, it does take away some of your speed and you're not able to run as fast. But a, a, a pro of that is you actually go on to take less damage. So that's a plus. Just you got to take things into consideration like that because Rockstar wouldn't throw things out in front of you like this for no reason and give them to you. So use things like that. Use the armored suits, the bulletproof helmets, for example, the bulletproof cars and the armored cars and, and things like that. Now, lastly, of course, you need to play strategically and think outside the box. I would definitely recommend that you and your team play through all the heists at least once. I know that'll take a day or so, but... Do that so you guys get a basic idea of what's going down and how this is going to work. And once you guys complete that, all the heists one time, definitely go back and do it again. But this time, do it and try to complete the challenge. So, 
uh, that's kind of my tips on how to complete this heist. Like I said, the issue that I ran into is that we just, the, the people I was playing with, we couldn't find the right time to uh, all get on because some people have work, school, etc. So uh, definitely you guys should try this yourselves. I'm going to go back and hopefully we can get everybody together and do this uh, as well because that is an awesome, awesome reward at the end. 10 to 12 million dollars. That would allow you to buy the Hydra, the Savage Helicopter, etc. All these awesome new heist vehicles in the game. So, if you guys did enjoy the video, of course, definitely be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and uh, if we could go for 300 likes, like I said, that would be awesome and greatly appreciated. Check out my Instagram and Twitter links. Those are down below in the description. But, with all that said now the way, I believe that's just about it. You guys all take it easy, have a safe one, and I will talk to you later. Bye.